In this chapter, we mainly explore how to import the external light library into the console. First, we need to prepare a USB flash drive. You can use the USB flash drive configured on our console. First, we need to create storage path for the light library. We'll start by plugging the USB disk into the USB port on our controller. In the lower right corner of the controller screen, click the Options Library. Then click in the upper right corner Open. We can see all the built-in light library files of the current controller in this interface. We randomly select the light library file and quickly double-click it. Then go to the Select Light Library editing screen. Then click the Save icon in the top right corner of the screen. Select your disk and click OK. At this time, the light library we selected has been imported into the U-Disk. At the same time, it will automatically create a storage folder of the light library in the U-Disk. We can unplug the USB flash drive and plug it into the computer now. We double-click to open the Kingquang folder. You can see subfolders with many different names. Our touch series controller's light library needs to be stored in a subfolder named library. Double-click to open this subfolder library. We can copy and paste the light library which we need into this subfolder. Also, the light library we exported from the controller is in this subfolder. We plug the U-Disk back into our controller. Click on the option library in the bottom right corner of the screen. Click on the upper right corner open, and then in the top left corner of the screen. On the left side appear browser and import. We're 20 light library. I made light library. Click Browser and Import. Click on U-Disk. Then select the corresponding light library. Click Import. If it is more than one light library, you can directly click to import all. We also can quickly find the light library we want by the manufacturer and the name of the light library. 